guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lexi. Today I'm going to be showing you everything I got in our four boys Easter baskets. I wanted to try and stick to the basics this year and be really minimal and mindful about what I got them, as well as stick to a budget. So each boys basket is going to be um, right around or less than $15 and everything we got is from the Dollar Tree. The only thing we didn't get at the Dollar Tree are their buckets. Um, but these are from Walmart. They're $1.50, I believe, each year. And we've had these ones for years and just keep reusing them. So I have their baskets pretty stuffed full. But everything, like I said, is from the Dollar Tree. So it's very budget friendly. And I will go through each boy's by age. I do want to give a little disclaimer. If you can hear some chirping in the background, we have our baby chickens over here in their brooder. They are so cute. But they are in the video before this if you would like to see them. Um, I documented going to Tractor Supply and getting them and setting up their brooder and bringing them home and everything. Uh, yeah, they're just being very crazy and loud. I think they just laid back down, but they were just being pretty hectic while I got everything out. But yeah, I'm going to go through each boys individually and tell you their age and show all their items. Each kid has right around 10, give or take one or two items in their basket, 10 items. So I'm going to start with Oliver. He is my eight year old. He is my little naturey boy. So you'll see that he loves reading and everything. So a special treat that each of the older three got is a glass bottle root beer. Sorry, my toddler's yelling. But they each got a glass bottle root beer. That's a special treat for them because it makes them absolutely feral when they drink root beer. Like you would think it's caffeinated. So they got that. And then each of the older two got a beef jerky pack. And they each got a pack of Peeps. I get these every year. To me, it's like a classic Easter staple. Even if they are a little gross. But Ollie got these blue ones. So that are, that's his like little snack pile. He got this butterfly fishing net. Um, I mean, it's not good for like actual fishing probably. It's pretty lightweight in the net area. But he has these over at my mom's house and uses them to catch frogs and things in her pond all the time. So I grabbed him one of these to take when we go, um, we go like swimming at the lake and to creeks and things like that to play all the time in the summer. So he'll have one of those. He also got this inflatable globe. Um, he's really having a fun time learning about geography and everything. So I thought this would be a good way. It shows all the countries. I don't know if you can see that like printed on it, but he'll be able to actually look at it as a globe. And I also thought it'd be fun for them to play with. It's basically like a beach ball. He got a Nerf style football, like one of these foam ones. They'll all play with this, but it's going in his basket got a pair of sunglasses these are you know just cheap ones but they get lost broken busted all the time he always needs a new pair because he plays baseball and they get forgotten places things like that so one of those he got I'm missing some of his stuff oh it fell on the floor sorry my chair is so squeaky we gotta fix them but he got a pack of socks his are video game themed and stripes. The last few things he got are books. So he got another sketch pad. He always needs another one. He goes through these so quick. It's always a safe bet to put one of these in a gift for him. And then the last two things for Oliver are two Hardy Boys books. I was so excited to find these at the Dollar Tree. He, um, He's read a couple of these. We have a few and he gets them at his school library, but he, I don't think has read these and I know we don't have them. So he got Sports Sabotage and A Monster of a Mystery. So that is everything for in Oliver's basket. Next up is Henry. He is my five-year-old. He is very into sports and cars. So you'll see a lot of that in his. He got a root beer. His peeps are birthday cake themed. Uh, he got this Monster Jam puzzle, so it has like little cartoon versions of all of the monster trucks on it. He got two Hot Wheels. Um, his favorite color is pink, so I got him this pink race car one. And then one of the mini monster trucks, but he doesn't have this one in the bigger 
monster trucks either so he'll be super excited to get a new one he um i guess i showed you or no i didn't yet he also got a pack of beef jerky he got socks but his are sports themed he got this little wooden airplane to put together. He likes these types of things that make him focus. Oliver got one of these pens in, um, I don't know, it was like a reward at school, I think, or something recently. And Henry was so jealous. So I got him one of his own. It's, you'll, you'll remember, I'm sure from growing up, but you can like click the different colors and can change it. So I found this Mickey Mouse one and got him that. Um, he also got a few books. He got this Bible coloring book and activity book. He got a leveled reader Daniel gets scared book. And then the last thing for Henry is this Pinocchio color by number book. He loves the movie Pinocchio, especially the new one on Netflix. So he'll like these and the coloring. Like it's they're pretty simple coloring activities. So that'll be something fun for him to do. Next up is Sam. Um, he is my wild child and he also loves coloring and art. So you'll see a lot of that. He got a root beer. His peeps are these like sparkly wild berry ones. And then he's not as big of a fan of beef jerky. So instead of that, I got him one of these ginormous carnival lollipops. I know I'm going to regret this. I know he's going to be a sticky mess and he's going to be wired all day after he eats that. But lollipops are his favorite. So he'll be super excited about it. For in his basket with that, he got this Spidey and his Amazing Friends activity set. So it has markers, stickers, and a little coloring book. He got a giant slinky. He loves slinkies and we're always, you know, breaking them. They always, if he gets to pick something out of a prize box, like at church or something, it's always a slinky. And so he'll be excited to have a jumbo one. Um, he got a uh, watercolor paint pot set. Sorry, I was missing some stuff. But he got this watercolor palette. Um, he goes through these really quickly. So got him another one of those. He got this little bug catcher set. So it has a little mini net, some like tweezers to pick up bugs with and a little observation tank so he'll be out there I'm sure catching roly polies and slugs and everything like that and studying them all summer he got a big sketchbook he's just getting into drawing things on his own like little stick figures and stuff so I got him his own sketch pad and then his last thing is um, he also got a Bible coloring book. So it's the same as the other one. It has Bible activities and coloring pages. It just has different pictures. So that's everything for Sam. Lastly, we have Louie. So like I said, he'll be one right after Easter, which I just can't believe it. It's his last first holiday. And, um, yeah, I'm a little emotional about it, but that's okay. So he got, he has a lot of snacks in his because he just, doesn't understand and his birthday is right after Easter so um one of the toys he got is this little pinwheel it's like an iridescent colored one and I know he'll like that he likes like all of the sensory stimulating stuff he got this little plastic dump truck and for $1.25 it's pretty heavy duty but he'll be able to play with that outside he got one of these big squishy like rubbery silicone balls. He loves these, but they get popped pretty quick sometimes in our house. So always fun to get him another one. Uh, I got him a little pair of bunny ears to wear with his first Easter outfit to church and lunch and everything that we do that day. He got um, a Cookie Monster sippy cup. He's just starting to use sippy cups. He's just about to be 11 months. And so I grabbed him one of these. Um, he likes the straw ones, but the Cookie Monster one was just cute. And I knew it would fill up space in his basket. Everything else for him is edible. So he got a pack of these white cheddar snap peas. Some of these apple cinnamon fruit bars. Some rainbow goldfish. Oh, I didn't show, but this came in a pack of four. These little jelly bean boxes. So I put one in each boy's basket. 
I don't know if he'll even be able to eat jelly beans. He'll probably just suck on them, but um, I'm sure my husband will help him out with those. And then he didn't get a whole pack of peeps because he's so little, but I got him one chocolate covered marshmallow peep. And that is everything for his basket. I will show a little pan over of all four of their baskets once they're like assembled and filled and you'll be able to see how everything fills out the basket. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'm back to posting regular content, so I'm posting at least one video each week. If you like this one, please help me out and hit subscribe down below. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and a blessed Easter.